It's a message for Prime Minister. My name is Nick Wilson. I'm an army veteran who proudly served Queen and Country for 14 years, where I deployed on multiple operations around the globe, including Northern Ireland, Kosovo, Iraq and Afghanistan. I've seen the horrors of humanity, sir. The horrors of war. The horrors of being fired at. The horrors of losing my brothers and sisters to insurgents and roadside bombs. The horrors of war, which used children strapped with bombs to attack us. I'm now physically and mentally disabled because of the service that I proudly gave to Queen and Country. I chose to go on operations and chose to fight for my country. Therefore, I accept my disabilities and I don't blame anyone. In fact, it's actually empowered me to help people and has helped me to identify a purpose. But when I continue to lose Every day, men and women, boys and girls, who feel they have no other option but to take their own lives. When this is increasing, when 75% of all suicides in the UK remains to be of males. If mental health is improving so well in the UK, why has this 75% statistic not dropped? Why are things increasing? The mental health crisis brought on by the pandemic. It's arriving. It's here now. It's taking people's lives. For every suicide, 135 people's lives are devastated. Time is now, sir. The time for change is here. And this is the perfect opportunity for us to rise again. More resilient, stronger, but with hope and belief. But if you don't act now, sir, I promise you, you're going to devastate tens of thousands of lives. If I died tomorrow, sir, would you know? Would you even care?